Busby with Scott Stone. Drew Willett at Studio Control in downtown Henderson. As we get you set for Henderson County High School Colonels basketball, the Colonels welcoming in the Evansville Christian Eagles. The Eagles come in with a record of 10-7. and seven. Henderson County 6-8. and eight. First meeting between these uh, two schools in any sport. And they'll square off on the hardwood tonight here at Colonel Jim. D. Patrick Ford presents our keys of the game. Scotty, what are the keys for a Colonel's victory here over Evansville Christian tonight? Well, number one is tempo. we got to get this game played a whole lot faster the way we like playing. Uh, the last game was uh, definitely not the pace that we wanted, so we got to speed Evansville Christian up. Number two, got to rebound the basketball. Been having a little bit of issue with that uh, last couple of games. Uh, been kind of equal or a little bit uh, losing the rebounding battle. we got to do a better job. we got to get in there, get those boards. And number three, Greg, needs some confidence. Uh, we lost, I believe, five out of the last six. Had a four-game losing streak in there. Uh, so we just need to get some confidence, get some, uh, get a win under our belt, and uh, get some confidence going into some important games coming down the stretch. Uh, yeah, just uh, three weeks left in the regular season before the district tournament begins here uh, at Henderson. So uh, it'll be three weeks from tonight. Colonels will be playing Union County in the opening round of the district tournament on a Monday night. So on the 15th of March, it'll be here before you know it as the Colonels look to uh, kind of figure things out down the stretch. Seems like they've kind of got the rotation they'd like, Scotty. Uh, but still, got to find a way to score some points. Yeah, it's big plus that you you figured that out. Now, though, you got, like I said, you know, and some of that scoring points is, you know, one's going to be the speed of the game. We want to play fast. Even though you're only going to play with, you know, seven or eight, you still want to play fast. That's just the way we play, and that's, you know, been in the mindset of these kids for a long time. That's just the way we play. We play fast. And when we play fast, good things happen. But to play fast, Greg, you've got to rebound the basketball. You can't be getting beat on the board, so we've got to do a better job of that. And also – uh, fans, just give you a heads up. We'll be giving you updates with the Lady Colonels as they're on the road at the Sports Center tonight against a big-time third-region opponent, Owens Brook County. Yeah, and I think that game, uh, probably 20 minutes in, was supposed to tip off around 7, I think, a little bit earlier than the actual um, boys game here tonight. So if we get something on that, as Scotty mentioned, we'll pass it along to you here on WSON. Evansville Christian 10-7, and seven, Henderson County 6-8. and eight. Henderson did win the JV game by the final score of 53 to 19. The varsity matchup coming up next and the starting lineups presented by Collier and Company Real Estate after this on WSON. In Henderson, the Colonels squaring off against Evansville Christian. Our officials for tonight's game out of the second region, Leif Riggs, Kelly Bennett, and Steve Scott. Colonels in their home whites with maroon numerals. Meanwhile, Evansville Christian in their road royal blue numerals trimmed in gold with the white letters. As we'll go down to the voice of Colonel Jim, listen in from our headsets to get the starting lineups here tonight. From the gym. Ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Colonel Jim here on the campus of Henderson County High School for tonight's high school basketball action. Tonight, your Henderson County Colonel's host, the Evansville Christian Eagles. Let's make the starting lineups for tonight's game for the Missouri Eagles. Thank you. 
That's the voice of Colonel Jim, Steve Town, with our starting lineups brought to you by Collier and Company Real Estate. Colonels won the coin toss, so they'll get the basketball to start here tonight playing Evansville Christian Colonel Jim. A, a one quarter played in Owensboro on the Lady Aces lead the Lady Colonels 6-3. That one getting ready to go to the second period. Sabo score, Greg. Yeah. <laughs> Wilkes to Bug, three in the left corner to start for Xavier Bug. It's off, no good. Rebound being battled for underneath. This will be a jump ball, and it will belong to Connor Sharp. And the Eagles, as he and Curry were tied up on the jump ball. Actually, good job there by Curry to get that jump ball. At least we'll get the possession back, Greg. Sharp in the backcourt, some pressure from Henderson. Curry and Wilkes now comes near side to Dunham. Denham gets it into the corner to Lindsay. Left baseline for him. Now it comes back out front to Santa Maria. Now Denham. Into the corner. Santa Maria fakes a three. Lost it, but it goes right into the hands of Jake Schepner, who puts it up and in. Loose ball found Schepner and Evansville Christian a 2 0 lead. Gerard Thomas to Noah Curry. Right side for Henderson County. Into the right corner to Bug. Now gets it out high left to E.Y. Wilkes. Now Curry driving left baseline. Cut off 12 feet away. Tramp and had it stolen away by Lindsey. Colonel's an early turnover. And the corner, three-pointer on the way for Dunham. Good. Josiah Dunham, the six-foot freshman, averages 20 a game off to a good start. And a timeout, Henderson. 5 nothing. Evansville Christian. We played a minute, 14 seconds. Back after this on WSON. If you're in need of health care but uneasy about visiting an urgent care or doctor's office in person, Owensboro Health is here to help. We are now offering telehealth virtual visits with your provider from the safety and comfort of your home. Just call your doctor's office to set up a virtual appointment. Considering a visit to an Owensboro Health urgent care? Call before you go and ask about a virtual visit. Find out more at owensborohealth.org slash virtual visits. You're listening to Henderson County High School Colonel Basketball here on 860 AM and 96.5 FM, WSON, Henderson, Kentucky. Colonel's basketball after Evans Hill Christian scores the first five points of the game. Curry bounces over to Wilkes out high left. Now back to Curry on the right side, right corner to Bugs. Three on the way for X. That one, an air ball over the rim, no good. Rebounded by Sharp. Bugs 0 for 2 from 3. Sharp with the basketball here. The jumps are regarded closely by Curry. Three in the corner on the way for Dunham. No good. Offensive rebound, though, by Lindsey. And a second chance for the Eagles. Left side with it. Schneebler fires a three. It's off. But he was fouled behind the three-point line by Bug. And Schnepper will go to the line for three free throws. First First on Bug. First on the Colonels. And Jake Schnepper. At the line. Schnipper, just a 53% free throw shooter as a team. The Eagles shoot 65% from the line. Boy, rough start for the Colonels, Greg. They're going to have to go against this zone. They're going to have to get the ball in the middle, get it down low, and get an easier shot, Greg. Get on the board and get your press set up. Schnipper hits his second. He's got three points, and we'll have one more free throw. Oh, Lady Colonels must be in a dogfight. Six to three after one quarter. Goodness. Second free throw, or third free throw, I should say. No good. Rebounded by Curry for Henderson. Noah to Wilkes on the left side. Back to Curry straight away. Right wing to Bug. Now Bird in the corner trying to get it back to Bug. Colonels turn it over again. Going the way with the basketball is Santa Bria. It's blocked by Curry. But coming out with a rebound. Is Dunham. Killing us on the glass. Now Lindsay, 15-footer right side, no good. 
Bug there for a rebound, and he's fouled by Schnepper. Schnepper's first and the first on Evansville Christian. 6 nothing. Eagles with the lead here at Colonel Jim, and we've played a little over two minutes. Wilkes to Curry. Backdoor lob bird actually hit the rim, and it goes out of bounds. Yeah, zone causing us a lot of trouble. The Colonel's just going to have to be patient, work their way in there, get a bucket, and then you can set up that press, try to try to get them a little quicker tempo. But when you turn the ball over out of bounds, they can kind of slow down, set up what they want to set, a little easier to break the press. Yes, the Colonel's third turnover. 6 nothing, Christian. 5.25 to go here in the opening quarter. Here's a nice drive to the basket and rolling around the rim but not going. Offensive rebound put back up and in by Lindsay after Sharp couldn't get the roll. Lindsay just more effort right there against the Colonels. Yeah, more one-two, Greg. 8-0 yep. Eagles with 5.10 to go. First period, Curry a three on the right side. No good. Noah's really struggled from three. And a rebound foul. I think on Bug, if it is, it's two. Yeah, Bug's picked up his second personal foul on that rebound. Yeah, Colonel's settling for threes, Greg, against this zone. In the first three minutes, we've already shot four threes, Greg, to just two two-pointers shots, and we're 0 for 4. Curry, yeah. a good shooter, but he has struggled this year from three, shooting just 16%, 7 of 44 now on the season after that miss. He's just going to have to keep driving, man. He does really good when he drives. Here's a three right side. Good for Connor Sharp, a 46% three-point shooter. And the upstart, all eight. Evansville Christian Eagles lead 11 to nothing here in Henderson. Timeout with 4.49 to go on the first. Back after this on WSON. If your current vehicle is on its last leg, don't keep pouring more money into it. Just push, pull, or tow it to Henderson Chevrolet Buick GMC and get at least $2,000 more for your trade. Or use it to double your down payment up to $2,000 and choose from over 200 pre-owned vehicles in stock. Check out our great selection at HendersonChevrolet.com. Good credit, bad credit, or no credit, we want to earn your business. Find your roads or cross that money-saving bridge and get $2,000 more for your trade only at Henderson Chevrolet Buick GMC. Littering and illegal dumping in Henderson County is at an all-time high. If you're carrying a load of trash or debris in your truck bed, be sure to tarp your load and strap everything down. And for those dumping illegally, a $500 fine will be coming your way. Henderson County Recycling and Solid Waste would like to remind county residents that free residential dumping is available at the Henderson Landfill and Transfer Station Monday through Saturday from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. Keep Henderson County litter free. This message brought to you by Henderson County Recycling and Solid Waste. 449 to play in the first quarter. Evansville Christian 11, Henderson County nothing here at Colonel Jim. Evansville Christian coming in 10 and 7. The Colonels coming in 6 and 8. Colonels have lost six of their last seven. Braden Lyons into the game for the first time, as is Kobe Reed for Henderson. Bugs out with those two fouls. And Bird on the bench with Reed out there. Here's Gerard Thomas penetrating in left side. Lost the handle, but it goes to Curry in the left corner. Now it brings it back out front to Eli Wilkes. Wilkes into the paint. Good dish down low to Reed. Couldn't wow. handle the pass. A little bit in front of him, and another Colonel turnover. They're fourth. Yeah, that was going to be an easy bucket. Done better pass. Kick out front with the basketball. Is Santa Bria. Good look down low and an easy bucket for Hunter Lindsay. He has four and a nice pass. From Santa Maria, 13 nothing Eagles. Bad news, you're down 13. Good news, just four minutes into the game. I guess you could say that's also bad news, too. <laughs> we'll see how the game ends, I guess. A lot of time left in this one. Here's oh Thomas. He goodness. traveled out front. We've played just over four minutes. The Colonels have no points and five turnovers. They do not look ready, Scotty. No, I think they looked at that JV game and thought I this going to be so a cupcake. Too. I think they see that small school, and they look a little rattled here early on. With the basketball, Dunham hands it off to Sharp. Run a little weave out front. Back to Dunham straight away. Wilkes on him. Dunham, the freshman against the senior Wilkes. 
Kick out to Santa Maria. Now a three on the way for Dunham. Dunham hits another three. And another timeout, Henderson County's. Dunham's got six, 16 to nothing. Evans or Christian on top of Henderson here at Colonel Jim. 325 to play in the first quarter. We're back after this on WSO. At Dunaway's Imperial Pharmacy, home health care is an important part of our business because it's important to you. So when your doctor says it's okay to convalesce at home, we'll be here for you with wheelchairs, crutches, canes, walkers, incontinent, ostomy, colostomy, and diabetic supplies, and counseling. When home health care is a prescription, Dunaway's Imperial Pharmacy is here for you. 110 3rd Street in Henderson. We'll be here for you. Dunaway's Imperial Pharmacy. When looking for an auto mechanic, most people look for honesty and experience. Ewing Tire delivers both and offers a wide range of automotive repair services, from brakes, alignments, shocks and struts, to tire rotations and oil changes, as well as tire sales. Ewing Tire has been in business since 1964, always providing friendly service, quality work, and products. So the next time you need tires or automotive repairs, see the team at Ewing Tire, 642 North Green Street, or call 270-826-8491. Three twenty-four to go, first period. Evansville Christian 16, Henderson County nothing. Colonel's had to use three timeouts to get it to Bug on the baseline. Back in there with two fouls. He threw it away. Colonel six turnovers, and then up to four. It's knocked away from behind by Connor Sharp. Good ball. Good job by Wilson Curry to break up a transition bucket. But the Eagles will play it in and they throw own basket. We might left of the lane. We might spot them 20, Greg. All right, spotted them 16. Inbounds pass knocked away, and it's out of bounds off of Evansville Christian. That's the Eagles' first turnover of the ball game. But this is what I talked about earlier. You know, we need, we just need some confidence. Four out of five losses. Yeah, six out of seven. I mean, six out of seven. Yep. Uh, six out of seven losses. We just need some confidence. Just under three minutes to play opening period. Here's Lions, a three right corner. Good look, WB3 for the senior Braden Lions who gets the Colonels on the board at the 250 mark of the first. Three pointers brought to you by a former Colonel, now your local Edward Jones investment advisor, Walker Bruner. Now steal by Wilkes near midcourt. Three on one with Wright and Curry. Gets it to Wright, puts it up and in. There we go, getting a little faster tempo. Had two shots fall. And we're down by 11, Greg. <laughs> 16-5, Evansville Christian lead, 2.20 to go in the first. And Wilkes knocks another one away. Loose ball, Wilkes down there on the floor. This will be a jump ball, I believe. Yep. Colonel and it will go to the Colonels as Wilkes tied up Schnepper to get another steal. Eli Wilkes back-to-back -back steals for the Henderson County. Colonels have scored five in a row. To cut the lead to 11 after Evansville Christian scored the first 16 points of the game. We used three timeouts. Wilkes straight away. Lions right corner. Now to Curry. Right back to Wilkes. Eli into the paint. Tough shot from eight. Go. More of that. Yeah, no doubt. 16-7. Just under two minutes to go the first period. Evansville Christian and a hand check foul out front. Pretty good call. On... Eli Wilkes guarding Dunham a little too closely. Wilkes picks up his first and the third against the Colonels. Lady Colonels struggling to score tonight. They trail 16 to 13 at the half. So I would say, Scotty, Owens Royal Catholics doing a good job against the Lady Colonels pressure. Doing a good job and the Lady Colonels are shooting horrible. Here's a kick out three point try for Schnepper. Good into the right corner. Schnepper with six here in this opening quarter. His first three pushes the Eagles' lead back to a dozen with a minute and a half to go in the first period. They are three of four from Trayville. They're killing us on the glass. Goodness. And here's a deflection out of bounds by Dunham at a stay with the Colonels. But good news is it's early, early, early. I think uh, just a brief warning from the referee, Steve Scott, to have only one coach standing up over on the sideline over there. 
Noah Curry with the basketball at the jump circle, guarded by Dunham. Left side to right, right back to Curry between the circles. Now Wilkes, a three on the way. High off the rim, no good. Rebound being tapped around. Knocked loose by Wright, wow. and it's still oh. loose on the floor. And a timeout. Evansville Christian as it was finally done him there to secure it. 101 to play in the opening period. Timeout. Evansville Christian 19. Henderson 7. It's on WSOM. Do you find it hard to save? Hi, this is John Hobby with Farmers Bank. Build your savings account with the simple way with Farmers Bank and Trust Sensible Savings. Every time you use your Farmers Bank Visa debit card, we'll round up your purchases to grow your savings account. Let's say you spend $2.50 for your morning coffee. We'll round that up and $0.50 cents will go to your savings account. To open a sensible savings account, come see us at Farmers Bank on South Green Street. Farmers Bank and Trust Company, member FDIC. 61 seconds to go in the opening quarter here from Henderson's Colonel Jim. Evansville Christian leads Henderson County 19-7. Eagles ball with a full court pressure from Henderson. Asaya Dunham up to Florida Lindsay. Now here's Williams. Kicks it in the corner to Sharp for three. No good. Rebound being tapped around. Dunham offensive rebound. Back up it won't go. And now Curry clears it out for Henderson. 40 seconds. Bug fakes the three in the right corner. Puts two Eagles in the air. Now to Wilkes. The Lions in left corner. Right a fire three in left wing. No good. Missed it badly. And a rebound into the hands of Lindsay. Up the floor to Dunham. 22 seconds to go. First period. 12 point lead for Evansville Christian playing Henderson County for the first time. Just their third year of basketball at the school. With it on the right side is Williams. Into the paint, try to go down low, knocked away by Lyons. Bug up the floor to Wilkes. Eli, a little floater at the buzzer, goes from four feet. Big play there to end the first quarter. We played one, Colonels trail Evansville Christian, 19-9 here on WSON. You have questions, we have answers. Hello, I'm Amanda Hardy with the Henderson County Cooperative Extension Service. UK Extension provides practical, research-based information to help people, businesses, and communities build a better future. We offer programs and assistance with agriculture and natural resources, family and consumer sciences, 4-H youth development, horticulture, and community and economic development. To see how we can help you, contact the Henderson County Cooperative Extension Service at 826-8387. With all the financial Financial headlines, are you wondering if your retirement savings will last? The market's ups and downs can keep you guessing, especially if you're approaching retirement or considering it. Hi, I'm Edward Jones Financial Advisor Walker Bruner. If you have more questions than answers about what's next, let's work together to help ensure you're prepared for your journey. After all, retirement isn't the end of the trek, it's a new beginning. Stop by our office at 2630 U.S. Highway 41. Edward Jones, making sense of investing, member SIPC. This is Amanda Hardy at the Henderson County Cooperative Extension Service. You're listening to Henderson County Basketball on 860 AM, 96.5 FM, and WSONradio.com. Start of the second period, Evansville Christian with the lead on the basketball. As the Eagles scored the first 16 points of the game. They have a 10-point lead now, 19-9, here at Colonel's Gym in Henderson. Santana Williams goes inside, and Curry blocks the shot of Sharp, rebounded by Bug. Curry leads the team in blocks this year. Lions to the three, right corner. Braden Lions knocks down his second three-pointer. The senior coming in shooting 40% from three. Loves those corner threes. Cuts the lead to seven. <laughs> we need a couple more of them. Williams fakes the three, gets it inside, and a shot blocked by Thomas getting his own rebound. Lindsay back up no good, and Lyons clears it off. Up the floor, Curry right side, some contact. Possible three-point play for Curry as he gets it off the glass and is fouled by Santa Bria. Farmers Bank shot for Curry. Farmers Bank thinks long-term, always have, always will. See how that makes all the difference. 
At Farmers Bank, 1555 South Green Street in Henderson, Colonels could cut it to four here with a make from Curry. Remember all that started after that block shot from Curry. And the Colonels within four, 19 to 15, with 7.05 to go in the half. 8 0 run. Here's Lindsay right side, cuts in the lane, puts it up and in. Hunter Lindsay with six points and four rebounds. A lead back to six for the Eagles. Gerard Thomas gives it up to Curry. Back over to Wilkes. Lions three, left side. Well short, no good. Rebounded by Williams for Evansville Christian. Right side to Sharp. Sharp with it out high right now. Bounces to Sam Brino, who fires a three and hits. Santa Bria's first points. All five Christian starters have scored. Wilkes fires a two, it won't go. Rebounded by Dunham. Dunham straight away had it knocked away and stolen away by Noah Curry. Curry a layup with the left hand on the other end. Yeah, they're four of six from Trayville. They come in uh, not bad. They shoot 37% from three as a team, Scotty. Oh, boy. Here's a three in the corner. Good look from Sharp. That one off, no good. Rebound out of bounds. Last touched by Dunham, and it will go to Henderson. I'll tell you, though, they're getting almost two good looks. Defense definitely picked up, though, gets some easy steals, which we expected to be able to get. Bug out for Henderson as William Bird re-enters. Down seven, though. You got to be happy since it was 16 to nothing to start the game. 24-17, just under six minutes to go in the half. Gerard Thomas back it down, 10 feet away. Had his pass deflected, got it back, and a foul called on Dunham. Dunham's first. Each team with three team fouls now. Curry to play it in baseline right. In the left corner, Wilkes. Eli brings it out, out of the right-hand dribble. Now Gerard Thomas, a sophomore, little pass fake, kicks it back out to Wilkes, three left side. No good, long rebound out to Bird, second chance for Henderson. Lions a three, just right of the key. That one rolls off, no good, and rebound into the hands of Lindsey. Colonels, two of 11, Greg. Down them with the basketball right side for Evansville Christian there in their road blues. Colonels in their home whites. Colonels went man to man. You see this very often. Five minutes to play first half, 24-17. Evansville Christian on top. Little give and go. They get it to Dunham, who finishes the layup on the pass from Santa Bria. Dunham with eight. It's going to be hard to go man to man unless they're going to switch on everything. Curry driving right side. Tough shot right of the lane. Off the glass. In and out. No good. Rebound loose on the floor. Wilkes and Bird down there. But it's Santa Bria coming up with it. And a three-point shot of the way for Santa Bria. No good. Rebounded by Lions for the Colonel. Up the four to Wilkes. Eli into the paint. Now brings it back out. Try to thread a needle getting the pass on the left block to Bird. Deflected out of bounds by Lindsay. It will stay with the Colonels. The Colonels got a... Not, you don't have to hit home run ball every single time. You're not... You know, you're within that. You're within shouting distance. Lions and Wilkes out. They go younger. Two seniors coming out for an eighth grader and a freshman. Satterfield and Davenport in. Lobbed a bird well over his head, and the Colonels throw it out of bounds. Curry was trying to get a lob over his head. Then Thomas tried to save it in but could not. Turnover number seven on the night for Henderson. Well, the Colonels got down to four, and they pushed it back to nine real fast. 26-17. Evansville Christian with the lead. 4-15 to play in the half. Dunham pull up 16-footer. Good. Dunham with 10, averages 20. We've still got four minutes to play in this first half. He's a player. 28-17. Noah Curry out high left, right side to Gerard Thomas. Now Davenport to Satterfield on the left wing in front of the Eagles bench. Cross court to Curry. Baseline, Euro step, tough shot, no good. Got his own rebound back on the floor. Up, no, but draws the foul. That's what we need Curry to do. That's just his game. 
has not been able to knock down those threes this year. But he can take it to the rack. He can get his own rebound off the miss, Greg. And then get fouled. Santa Bria hit with a foul. His second four against Evansville Christian now. Two free throws for Curry, and Noah knocks down his first. Number one, you want to keep this thing, get it under 10 before half. Number two, any bit of foul trouble is great. Make them go to their bench. Satterfield coming out as Bird returns to go a little bigger now. Curry hits both free throws. They get 28-19, 3.40 to go in the first half. Oh, boy. With the basketball, Sharp into the paint. Little jump stop, and he he did travel with the basketball. Good defense. Yeah, we about missed. They had a very good opportunity with quick pass in the middle. They could have just took a shot there. A wide open three. We got lucky. They chose not to. Curry straight away. And trying to go over to Thomas that went off the leg of Hunter Lindsay to stay with the Colonels is... Gerard Thomas will play it in down to our right, near side of the floor from where we sit, opposite the benches here at Colonel Jim, top row of the lower level. That's our COVID spot this year, staying socially distanced. Into the corner, Davenport, three right side. Cooper Davenport, the eighth grader, hits a big three. Three pointers brought to you by Walker Bruner, your local Ever Jones investment advisor. Colonel's pull within six. Here's Shepner. Good look to Lindsay, cutting the baseline from the left side. It puts it up and in. Hunter Lindsay with eight. Man, we're just not doing a very good job of watching the back door, Greg. They've hit that four times. Pass on the inside from Bug. Loose ball, diving on the floor. Bug and Lindsay a steal as Dunham has it, and he walks. Teams exchange turnovers there. Good hustle on both sides. Dunham got a little out of control. On the other end, the spin move. Hoping to get the foul. Didn't get the whistle. 30 to 22. Eight point Evansville Christian lead. With two and a half minutes of play in the half. Here's a near steal from Dunham. Picked up by Curry. Good look to Bird underneath. Kick out to Bug. Three on the way, right side. No good. Rebounded by Bird. Puts it back up and in. Need more of that from the big man. Two points, two boards for Bird, both of them on the offensive end. Colonels have cut it to six. With the basketball, Shepner on the baseline, cut off right side, out to Dunham now. Six foot fresh for Josiah Dunham, three right side, off the mark, no good. And this would be a rebounding foul, I believe, against Lindsey. Yeah, kind of had a hold of bug, it is. Lindsey picks up his first. Minute 55 to go here in the first half. 30 to 24. Evansville Christian the lead. Colonels trailed by as many as 16 as the Eagles scored the first 16 points of the game. Yeah, they were up 16 nothing in six minutes. Lady Colonels trailed 16-13 at the half at Owensboro Catholic. At Sports Center. Still Owensboro Catholic. Braden Lions, right wing. Out of Jordan right straight away. Davenport back to right. Be patient. Made it a half to play in the second period. Here's Gerard Thomas in the paint from 10. Kicks the Lions left corner. Now Davenport. Cooper into the paint. Lions fakes the three left side. Cut off on the baseline. Gets it back to right. Jordan picks up his dribble. Throws it away trying to get it to Davenport. Oh, yeah, just throw it behind him for a wide open three by Lions. Nine turnovers against Henderson here in this first half. Noah Curry, Eli Wilkes up off the bench. They'll be in as Davenport and Wright check out. Lady Colonels up 22 to 16 now. With four minutes going to third. So they are on a 9 0 run to start the court. Lindsey right side. Another easy layup for him on a nice pass from Schnepper. That's all he's got tonight, Greg. We're doing a bad job of. Finding that kid. He's got 10. Lead is eight for Evansville Christian with under a minute to play here in the half at Colonel Jim and Henderson. Gerard Thomas kicks to Wilkes, fakes a deep three in front of the Eagles bench. Bird now on the baseline, backing down in the post. Has it for six feet, shot up, just rolls off, no good, and a whistle. Late comes in, yeah. 
Might have been the right call, but yeah. it was late. I think they're going to get Lindsey with his second foul, and Bird will have a couple free throws. Bird, a 62% free throw shooter on the season. He'll have two, two points, two rebounds for William Bird tonight. Spins off his first free throw. Bird, second free throw, missed them both. In this case you're wondering, is Orangeburg Catholic very good? Uh, last week, they lost to Bethlehem, the fourth-ranked team in the state, by one point at the Sports Center in overtime. Rebound came from Tyler Shannon just into the game. Now Williams goes right side of Dunham, and it knocked away by Curry, and Curry has the steal. Noah in the paint. He's fouled on his way to the basket by Shannon. Curry's really active tonight. I love it. Attacking the glass, Greg, here in the second quarter. First quarter, he missed two threes. Now he's attacking the glass. He's already got seven points, and he's picked up three fouls on the opponents. Curry back to the line for two. Noah, three of three on the night from the line, 57% on the year. And this is his first free throw. He made three in a row, and then Bird missed two in a row, and now he's missed two in a row. So Lady Colonels with now 3.20 to go, still same score. So a 9-0 run for the Lady Colonels. Third quarter, right? I mean, yeah, sorry. Yeah, third quarter. Wow. Curry misses them both, rebounded by Lindsey. That hurts when you're down eight. Still got a chance to keep it under 10. No, you need to stop. Dunham with the basketball, guarded by Curry. Seven seconds left in the half. Williams now with it, left of the lane, kick out, three on the way for Sharp. High off the rim, no good. Thomas, a rebound for Anderson, and that is the end of the first half. Evansville Christian scored the first 16 points of the half. Colonels got it to within four once, but Evansville Christian pushes it back to eight. 32-24, your score here at the half. Evansville Christian on top of Henderson County. Stay tuned for Colonels at the half presented by DSS Reynolds. Coming up next here on WSON and WSONradio.com. Hello, this is Dr. Bob Lawson from Henderson County Schools with a reminder that we all need to work together to keep our community safe. Take the following steps every day to help avoid the spread of COVID-19. Wash your hands often with soap and water for at least 20 seconds practice social distancing, and wear a mask. These small actions will make a big difference. Protect yourself and protect others. Let's all pursue excellence together. This is Josh from H&H Construction and Supply. After 40 years of serving Henderson and the surrounding areas, we're excited to announce the opening of our sister store in Owensboro. Cabinet Outlet, located at 1601 Triplet, will have our leading cabinet brand as well as vinyl plank and laminate flooring, plumbing fixtures, and many other accessories for that do-it-yourself project all in stock for you to take home today. Did I mention we offer quality products at a lower price than the big box stores? Get the personal touch only a small business can provide. Cabinet Outlet, 1601 Triplet in downtown Owensboro. Hi, this is Mike Hazelwood with EM40 Company. At EM40, we insure many of the businesses and industries in the area. However, we're not just a commercial insurance agency. We're also a leader in personal lines insurance. EM40 Company has the experience and marketing ability to offer you a competitive and comprehensive insurance program that is tailored to your family's needs and budget. We will also be there when you have a claim. EM40 Company, your local source for personal lines insurance. EM Ford and Company on the Strip in Henderson. Call 270-830-8877. Fix up your home with Heritage. Our home improvement financing options can help you change your home now and pay for it over time. Upgrade your home. Make home repairs. Remodel a kitchen. Create a man cave. Remodel your bath. Whether it's a small weekend project or a large renovation, Heritage Federal Credit Union can help you finance your improvements today. Fix up your home with Heritage. Some restrictions apply. Rates, terms, conditions are subject to change about more recent church. They need to at Equal Housing Lender. Go to hfc.info for details about credit costs and terms. It's deer hunting season. That means deer are on the hunt for your vehicle. Team Collision Center wants you to know that deer are most active during sunrise and sunset. Now watch out for those deer crossing signs. They're there for a reason. 
see one deer, there's likely more to follow as deer travel in groups. And don't swerve to avoid a deer collision. By swerving, you put yourself at risk for a worse collision with another vehicle or possibly running off the road. Stay in your lane and try to slow down. And if a deer does hunt you down, visit Team Collision Center, your hometown collision center. Colonels at the Half is next on WSON, constructed by DSS Rentals. Back with halftime scoring and stats, next on WSON. Hey, Benny, have you ever noticed that Skid Steer kind of looks like a go-kart? Don't get any ideas, Jack. That's for rented Dad's new business, DSS Rentals. Dad noticed there are several small construction companies and plenty of do-it-yourselfers that could use light industrial equipment, like trenchers and a skid steer. Not a go-kart, Jack. That's right, Luke. DSS Rentals saves time and money for those folks. And Dad can get any piece of equipment for any project. Hmm, what about a go-kart? Stop by and see us at DSS Rentals on Highway 41 South next to Crestline. This is Matt Duncan with Farmers Bank. You're listening to Henderson County Basketball right here on 860 AM, 96.5 FM, and WSONradio.com. Welcome to Colonels at the Half here on WSON, presented by DSS Rentals. At the half, Evansville Christian leads Henderson County 32-24. The Eagles 